welcome back to another episode on the channel guys and we are playing more of red dead redemption i absolutely love that first episode that was amazing uh, i hope you guys enjoyed it i know this is an old game but look i've never played it before we've got to talk to bonnie again but we've we're in armadillo at the moment so we're going to go and talk to the guy in armadillo so let's continue where we left off I'm really hoping it saved us to a certain point, or are we going to have to go and do this again? I bet we've got to do this again. Woman and cattle, maybe not. Okay, cool. This is different. So we've gone back to where we were. Marston, I've been hearing about your plan. Have you, Miss McFarland? Yes, from Lee Johnson. To settle here and build a life for yourself. I'm afraid those aren't my plans. See, I already have a life. Well, I had one, and I'm trying to reclaim it. Maybe what you could say is I had two, and I'm trying to end one of them so the other can survive. You right. I love to talk in riddles, Mr. Marston. Do you do that? I wonder as a sub. I'm sorry, guys. Interesting to say. Probably, Miss McFarland. Oh, call me Bonnie, you fool. Call me Bonnie. Miss McFarland. I'm married. I have a son. I had a daughter, but she died. Years before that, I rode in a gang. We robbed banks, trains, held people ransom. We killed people we didn't like. Bill Williamson was in that gang. Now, if I don't capture my former brother in arms, great harm will befall my family. Ooh. Now, I don't suppose any of this is very interesting to you, but... I hope it explains why I wasn't so eager to talk about it. Wow. No, I do understand. I had no idea. You poor man. Even in this new country, memories don't really fade. My father was an illiterate Scot born on the boat into New York. He never saw his homeland, but to hear him talk about it, you'd imagine he only ever ate haggis and wore a kilt. And he hated the English for what they had done to his great-grandparents that he'd never met. People don't forget. Nothing gets forgiven. That's true. Especially when it comes to money. Mm. And you know, even now, after all his labors, my father's debts are still terrible. I worry every day about us losing the ranch. It would kill him. My father died when I was eight years old. His eyes were... Well... Let's just say he was blinded in a bar fight south of Chicago. Ouch. My mother died during childbirth. She was a prostitute and he was her... Well, I don't, I don't know what he was. So I was sent off to an orphanage and ran away and fell in with a gang. My word. What a difficult life you've lived. Uh, the leader of the gang taught me how to read. Taught me how to see all that was good in the world. He was a great man, in a way. But you killed people. Sure. And I've suffered for it. Mm. That's the life I left. I tried to leave. Uh, said too much, Bonnie. Aww. I'm an educated killer. Sent here to do all I can do well. Kill a man in cold blood so that another man may do his part to cut crime in an area. And a rich man can be elected governor on the back of these promises. Hmm. Civilization is a truly beautiful thing, Mr. Marston. <laughs> Listen, can you help me? Well, I can try. What do you need, money? No, nothing so complicated. I need an extra hand to take out the herd to pasture. <laughs> sure. Point me in the right direction. Oh man, so I'm take it as is that the gang in RD2? I think so. So the, the, the who were his brothers in arms? It's got to be because John was really young in that. All right, let's head over to the cow pen. It's about time a budding farmer such as yourself learned how to herd cattle. Okay, yeah. So we actually left off in Armadillo, but it's it's put us here because we haven't got any money. So. Thank you. 
understand now why I've been playing my cards somewhat close to my chest. I didn't know you had a wife and child. Then again, I don't think I ever asked. They're they're lucky to have a man like you. Ah. Good to see you, Mr. Carlin. Move into position, but I had the herd. Okay, that's fine. Herd the cows out the pen. Oh, nice. Cool. I am, I am, I am. I'm staying behind them. Pretend you know what you're doing. Let's go. Slowly sweep the. Oh my gosh, really? Come on. But they don't want to go. Oh, now they're going. Okay. Yeah, this game is holding up very nicely. I want to know who who we had to speak to in Armadillo, though, because I feel like. I feel like this. We haven't left off where we, we did, but I guess we have. It's just, we was in Armadillo, but I couldn't save it there. It's annoying. Oh, here we go. We're here. Nice. Whoa. Really? Okay. Right, let's... Come on. Come on. You as well. You as well. You as well. What are you doing? Look at the herd. Press. Let's go. Oh wow. Move, let's go. This is so cool, man. Look at that cow. <laughs> it's stuck on the horse. <laughs> Stay together, you dumb animal. Nice work. You're not bad with the herd. Ranching might be your true calling, Mr. Marston. Either that, or you were a cow in a past life. Thank you, Miss McFarland. I'll see you later. I have work to do back at the ranch. Come on, boy. Well, that's five. There we go. We made our first five dollars. Yeah, so. What I might do is quickly go over and talk to the guy over here because that's initially what I was going to do. Wait, what? You can save your game from anywhere in the wilderness. Yeah. Come on, bro. You're going to shout it to me now. Right, in addition to saving caps, provides you with a horse and additional ammunition. A true... Um, Frontiersman is a master of all aspects of the wood and the skills of that hunting and shooting across the land. Okay, cool. Let's just go over. The path to becoming a true legend is long and hard. Try shooting birds or skinning coyotes to start your way. Yep, I have a revolver. So how do I look at my guns? Oh, here. Nice. When, when do I get a lasso? Whoa, whoa. What is this? Oh my gosh, okay. Let's keep going, man. So the horse doesn't have a stamina bar here. Is there a way that I can like, get down? Right, try over here. I'm guessing... No? <clears throat> Let's have a look, see if we can find a way down. Here we go. Right. I know where we got to go. We've, we've been here before. So let's just go past you. Yeah. 
Right, come on. Let's go. So we gotta go to Yeah, Armadillo. Man, this it does hold up really well though. You know, like it it holds up extremely well. Like all in all. So this is where we were, right? So let's just go hitch our horse here. Let's do this proper. And let's talk to this guy. So this is called political... Oh, didn't even see it all. <laughs> Shut up, you! And what you want? My name's John Marston. You wanted to speak to me. I did. Apparently so. Was it Bonnie that said that? I guess because we're both in the business of the law. You that fella from the train company? No, I'm from Fort Mercer. Fort Mercer? You that one of Williamson boys? Calm down. Go on, shoot him, mister. Shoot him! <laughs> on, what? You, you getting keep with me, boy? What's going on here? I got me one of them Williamson boys. I got me one of them idiots who give marshals a bad name. Oh, <laughs> put your gun down. Must be the man from Blackwater. Yes, sir. Listen, that dog ain't too bright. But he seems loyal. Do you want to get out of here for a minute? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson, sir. So, Mr. Johnson, Jaina. Oh, I didn't see enough of your hide around here, friend. <laughs> I think there's some school children down the way. <laughs> oh, hardy fucking hard. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing here, Mr. Marston? Apart from frightening my deputies. I'm here to capture or kill Bill Williamson. <laughs> okay. Can you help me? He's outside my jurisdiction. He's in the next county. Of course, Bill Williamson and his boys have tended to keep themselves away from my town. So you're happy to have him out there? Well, I ain't happy, but I also ain't suicidal. My job is to keep this town safe, not clean up all of these three counties. It's hard enough around here. You know, I hear you speak, and suddenly I'm reminded of how some of the people I respected most in my life had a problem with authority. What's wrong with you? Well, I'm sure you, you and your fine friends have enjoyed spending your time running around pursuing noble causes. My cause is to keep this town from turning into a living hell for the folks who live here. The whole world has problems, mister. And I'm here, doing what I can. Why? What's happening? Right now? I got the railway, the people who pay my salary, trying to get me to turn a blind eye to them burning down settlements up there. I got a bunch of cattle rustlers out near Box Canyon need shutting down. Not forgetting the gang that keeps murdering homesteaders out in the back country. And I got a bunch of hoods over in the saloon, drunk, threatening to shoot up the whole town. That's all I got today. But it's early yet. Give me a couple more days. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Tell you what. Let's go deal with them hoods in the saloon. Then we'll discuss Williamson. Okay, boy. He likes us. You're 
a persistent little cuss, ain't you? Only when things matter. Oh, family, bro. John is a proper Finn Diesel. Let's head over to the saloon. John has definitely been watching the Fast and Furious films. Look at this. It's a... Who are we looking for? A bunch of two-bit hoodlums led by this fella called Walt. Walton, okay. Damn road agents who prey on the stages coming in and out of town. Drivers and armadillos spend more time with their hands in the air than on the range these days. And you're happy to let them drink in your saloon? Happy? No. But the way I figure it, better they're carousing in there than out robbing decent folks. That's an interesting approach to law enforcement. It is quite interesting, to be fair. Come on, let's get in here. Let's get involved. This dumb rat bastard now. Let's follow. Let's Him? Oh my gosh. My guy thinks he's in Peaky Blinders. He needs to take that top hat off right now. It's not doing anything for him. Let's go, Marston. Whistle. You can whistle your horse. As long as it is alive, your horse will come to you anytime. I'm waiting for my horse, man. Oh my god. Get on the horse. There we go. Tail Walton to his hideout with the Mar with Marshall Johnson. Do not kill Walton. Right. Gang's been growing fast. That lawn's easy money for easy work. Chola Spring, Gap Tooth Ridge. These boys get around. Walton's the start, but there's plenty more where he came from. Come on. Stay with me for Christ's sake. I am. I am. I'm here. Okay, yeah, I see it in the distance. What's the what's the move, Sheriff? Mr. Johnson, sir, Sheriff. What's the move? Come on, talk to me, mate. I need to know what's going on here. Come on. Looks like we got company, boys. Damn. Take cover. We'll work our way up this hill. Over here, puppy, puppy. Arson, I got you covered. Move up to that wagon. Arson, take that bastard behind the crate. That ain't nice. You ain't that tough, Walton. You ain't that long. Oh my gosh, let's go. Whoa! What was that? Don't think you'll be needing this. Where's the next one? There you go. I can swap cover. Cool. Right. The sh I know the sheriff's not saying that to me. I know the sheriff is not saying that to me. Let's go. That's Walt inside the house. Let's see if we can take him alive. How? By shooting him in the legs or dead. Oh! No! Let's go. Woo! Let's go. Not a bad shot, Mr. Marson. Thank you, sir. So now we've done that. Okay, so so RB is to cover. That guy is having an, a very uncomfortable ride to the jail. Let's go. We've got 25 now. Loot these bodies. 
I don't know if there's much there. Anything here we can loot? Oh, there is! Alternatively, dishonorable people will react positively if you have low honor. Honorable people will react negatively to low honor. Oh my gosh, $65? We've got now? Who is that shooting? Can you hear that? The marshal has left you a long way from the civilization. You can quickly travel back to the town using travel to destination feature on your camp. Oh my gosh. That's all we needed. All this stuff exists. After a battle... There it is. Amazing. Look at this. Amazing. You can fast travel to any inhabited location you discovered. Otherwise, you can place a waypoint anywhere on the territory map and then travel to the nearest... Right, okay, so what, what outfits have we got? Have we got any more? No, okay, we've got to do like challenges to get certain ones. Um, let's save. We might as well save this. Nice. Um, and then let's travel to destination. You can fast travel to any inhabited location you've discovered, otherwise you can place a waypoint on the territory map and then travel to the nearest road. Okay, let's go to McFarlane's Ranch or Armadillo. Let's go to Armadillo, because we've done a couple with Bonnie. Let's try and do a couple with... Oh, wow, look how pretty this looks, man. Look at that. It looks so cool at night. Let's just go... Uh, strangers found throughout the world are in need of assistance. Okay. Well, let's justice in Pike's Basin. Hello, hello, it's Armadillo Seven Three One. What is it with these things? Hello, it's a new line. Hello, hello. Sounds fun. What's happening? I have no idea. Yeah, if it's important, they'll send someone down like they did with you. Suddenly, the world is full of days. <laughs> I remember when we first got here. We used to consider people from Dade County to be exotic. Now guys can get here from the Midwest, and they can do it in six days. Things have changed. <laughs> You've gotten away from me. Hello? I don't understand it no more, boy. Honest to goodness. I'm not sure I do. <laughs> Marshal! Marshal! <coughs> Marshal! Who is this? I've just been up in the canyon, spying like you said. I think I've seen me a couple of them rustlers. I think it was the Baller Twins and a couple of Mexicans. They up there right now? Well, it was a group of four men rounding up Mr. Gulch's livestock, and none of them looked like any of Gulch's hands, so yes, sir, right now. That sarcasm's most unbecoming, Eli. Eli. Hold you back in life even worse than your lazy eye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you ride with us again, Marcel? <laughs> Help me. I will try. Be my pleasure. Oh my, we've already done something for him. John, come on, man. He's starting to use you now. Like, no, no, no. You said you'd help us a bit. Did he not? Did he not say he was going to do that after doing that? I swear my horse wasn't this color. I thought it was like silver. Made the rich richer and the poor poorer, and it's killed a way of life. 
building a factory over a field ain't gonna help nobody I know. Look at what they've done to the natives for God knows how many years now. It's hardly like they're gonna suddenly start respecting a man's right to work his land. That's different. They're savages. It ain't that different, Jonah. Hmm. I love... Sure was the Bollard twins, Eli? Sure as shoot. I'd know those boys any place. Are these the same rustlers who've been causing the McFarlane so much trouble? If you want to afford a rope around your neck, I'd advise you to stay on two feet around that ranch, Marston. Not far now. Eyes open, boys. Yeah, because she, because Bonnie said something about people causing problems. All right, boys. Whoa. Let's proceed on foot from here. Oh, now. Head for the fort. Stop, will you? Wait. LB shows the weapons. Select one. There we go. We're probably going to be outnumbered. And those bastards ain't short on firepower neither. Let's see how many there are. If we can take them alive, good. If not, smoke the sons of bitches. Pump. <laughs> Right, so we've got Jonah here, we've got Eli behind, we've got Mr. Uh, Mr. Johnson, the main boy, the boss, we've got Big Boss here. Did no one check, like, high ground? You know? Look out, Whoa! Oh my gosh, b brilliant shot. Oh, nice. How do, when the dot is faded, shots fired at the target become very inaccurate. Ah, B. B is reload. I'm going to cover you. If the two deputies... Right. Of course I'm going to go with the show. If I'm not going to leave him by himself... It's just going to get shot down. Ooh! I'm getting messed up! Ooh. Bro, I couldn't. Bro, I couldn't. I couldn't even get round, man. Right, one. Hang on. There's another one there. There's another one there. No? There's a couple of the rat bastards. Unbelievable reaction time. He's still alive? Did you hear the, did you hear the scream? I done the the Star Wars scream. What you got on? A Bollard Twins outfit. Oh. Will allow you to be treated like one of their gang in the Heineken still. Interesting. Where's th where's the marshal gun? Okay. Let's go. Okay, so how many more? It's saying there's one on the map. I can't see him though. Oh, I see him. Oof. Nasty. Put down your gun and surrender. Oh, they're there? Oh, he's still alive. He's just injured. Approach dead body and press Y to loot it for money ammo. Yeah, yeah, I've already figured that out. I'm getting shot at. Brilliant shot. Brilliant shot. Oh, my gosh. See... Mr. Johnson, so you're not really doing anything. Oh! Where? Where is he? Is he being serious? I'm waiting for him to pop up. There we go. 
Hey, Mons, move it now, move it now, move it now, move it now, move it now. Moved into different cover. Come on, boy, where are you? Nice. There's so much here. Yeah, search this. There's a lot here. Look at all the money we're getting. Oh my god, this is more like it. We have pennies compared to what we've got now. Amazing. That's more like it. Let's go. Can you, like, lose your hat in this? I'm pretty sure if you got punched in RD2, like, your hat came off. It was quite funny. And you could pick it up. Um, I must say it's weird how... I haven't played this game. I know, like, so many of you are probably... Gonna riddle me in the comments. But I'm just glad to be playing it. Snipers? What am I supposed? Where? What am I supposed to do? There's no cover. Where's the second one? Where's the second one? There. Yep. I like that. Oh my god, this is so fun, man. Oh! Where, 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 where? Oh, no, that's... Uh! Run! No, 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 no. Can you hear me tapping? Oh my gosh, I was there, bro. I was there. I was there. I was there as well. Fuming. Set casual targeting mode. Stop it. There's no... The thing is, right, is... There's... Where? He's not done with... Hang on. Right, let's just wait, because I think that actually... Well, hang on, because you're going to move. Can I wait? I can. No, 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 there's, th there's them. Where are they? Over there. Brilliant shot. Right, start moving now. I love the sounds, the sound design, man. Right, let's go. That's more like it. We want to roll now. You can tell when I'm like sprint. You can probably hear the tapping of the controller. Nice. As as I'm gonna put my mic up a little bit actually, just so I'm not bothering you guys too much with that tapping. I want to try and like keep it a little bit away from the. Oh my gosh, what? Have you seen them all down there? How, look, look, boys. They've heard us by now. They would have heard the gunshots. Like, come on. Let's not even act like we're trying to sneak up on them right now. Oh, yeah, look, they've, they've taken all the cattle. How many? Nice work, boys. Nice work, nice work. Right, let's keep moving. This is so cool. Ooh. Oh my god, I've got to run down with them. This is too much. My adrenaline is spiking. Let's go. It's either this game or it's the coffee. I think it's a bit of both. I'm scaring the cows. Let's go! Right, let's keep moving. Have we done it? We've done it. Let's go. And let's just loot up. Look how much money I've got now. We went from like 25 or something to 
$119 in one mission. Let's go, man. Good work. Thanks, Marshal. We're indebted to you with our lives. Just get them cattle back safe. All right. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. No worries, bro. Well done, Mr. Marston. Yes, well done. Now, about Williamson. Yes, I'll thank you. You know, as you can see, this country is infested with all manner of scum. Say that again. But one other thing, Marston. Mr. Johnson, <clears throat> sir. It's Mr. West Dickens. He's missing. What? Who? Mr. West Dickens, the tonics merchant. He was due in town last week. Oh, the narcotic and bat piss sales. Tonics <laughs> <laughs> housewives out of their money with promises of eternal youth. Yes, him, but I think you're being a little unfair. He's helped a great many of the county, and many of the townsfolk are really missing him. You hear that, Marston? We just butchered a gang of thieves. And the town is up in arms about a missing snake oil merchant. I am so glad to be serving such a wise and respectable people. Come on, Eli. <laughs> so good. So are these going back to um, Bonnie's farm? The McFarlane farm? Nice, man. Hundred oh my gosh, bro! Uh, money is going up. So Nigel West Dickens can be found in Colorado Springs. But who is Nigel? Who is Nigel? You can place waypoints with A on the Toto map in the pause menu. Well, hang on. There's some stuff here. Some more money. Let's just search around this area here. And then I think we'll go back to Bonnie. I think that's my plan. Go back to Bonnie, see what's going on with her. And I've got a new outfit, right? Can we actually, can we sit back? Was it here? Is this where I was? Oh, I've actually got to set up my own campfire. Okay, cool. Um, let's set up a campfire then. You cannot set in the sense of a gang hideout. Well, is it going to let me just sit down then? Oh my gosh, really? I've got to exit this. Right, new weaponry is available as well. I want to increase my firepower, power, but I don't at the moment. Oh my gosh. Come on, man. Not... Right. Let's get on my horse and get out of here. My horse is running away, look at him. Get your ass back here now. Thank you. Don't know what to call you yet. Thinking of a name. So let's go talk to Bonnie. Who are they? They're coming this way, who are they? What did he do wrong? This is my father, Drew McFarland. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. That is an impressive tash. Please. So, my daughter informs me that you're here on some secret mission to remove some undesirables from the county. Something like that. I'm grateful for the hospitality, sir. Well, you know, we've lived here for 30 years now. Came here from the east. The land had never been settled. For 10 years, we fought the Indians. Tough men. And we had outlaws, and we had drought, and we had smallpox, terrible winters, cholera, 
Hmm. I'm very warm, my children and I raised. Sorry to hear that, sir. I've seen strong men wither and die under that unforgiving sun. That whole herd of cattle take sick and die. But I've never once doubted my life here. That's crazy, man. When I hear about this so called federal government sending out agents to covertly murder and control people, then I start to worry. I mean, it, all right, Williamson is a menace. And men like him are the plague. Hmm. But isn't a government agent a worse menace? And all that symbolizes, I mean. You may be right, sir. Well, you're a brave man. You're always going to be welcome here. But you tell your friends out east that we don't want to live like that out here. And sneaking around and spying and secret mission. Preposterous. Trust me, sir. I agree with you. Good. Good. Well, we won't insult you any further. Come on, Bonnie. We got things to do. Mr. Marston, do you want to join us? It's Daddy's favorite pastime. Apart from political discourse, that is. What is it? Breaking in horses. Come on. I hear you're a pretty decent rider. For a city dweller, that is. <laughs> So, oh man, John's got a lot on his plate. Imagine he's got to take down people that he used to be, like, they used to be like his brothers, man. And as well as that, You're gonna need this, Mr. his family's being threatened. If he doesn't, his family's being threatened. That's crazy. But Look, John's you, one of them. That That's what I don't get. That ranch hand said there's a pack of wild horses nearby. There we go, we got our lasso, man. Where are we going, boys? You sure have some interesting theories on what the government's doing, sir. They ain't theories, Mr. Marston. I saw the telegram Marshall got from Blackwater. It ain't exactly a state secret and sent you. Well, is he wrong? I saw those men from the train. The government can go to hell if you ask me. Those sons of bitches would steal a coin off a dead man's eyes. Mr. Marston! He's right. Now, I don't know much about politics. Please, Paul, can we just enjoy the ride? But I know ride? we're only as free as they say we are. Power's like a drink. The more you have, the more you want. And there's few men who can handle it. There's certain things in this country a woman could do much better if you ask me. She's not wrong. I can't argue with that, Miss McFarland. Well, we're all in sync with our with our horses. Oh, not anymore. I I like I like um I like these people, man. I think these people are they're good people. They're good people. Oh, there's there's the herd. Is that the herd? What what? Oh my gosh! We're, we're gonna do it just like this. I want, I want this one. No. Yep, yep, yep. Start horseback. Dismount. I've done it. What do I do now? What do I do? 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 Whoa! Lean into it. This is crazy. This is crazy. Please calm down. Please calm down. Please calm down. Don't give up. Let's go! Yes, sir. Mount your horse. Oh, I kind of feel like I've got a connection to this horse now, though. What? Let's rope another one. 
Oh my gosh, I didn't realise, sorry. I didn't realise you wanted to rip another one, you didn't s- Look at this, look at this one out here alone. Let's go. Okay. This is cool, man. Okay, so let's do... Oh! Please stop, please stop, please stop, please stop. Calm, calm, calm. Calm, please, calm, please, calm, please, calm, please. It's relaxing, it's relaxing, it's relaxing. It's relaxing. There we go. There we go. Damn! I'm on him? <laughs> At least let me get off of him first before you just decide to spook the horse. He is. So sad, man, because John just wants out. Like, he doesn't even want to be doing this, does he? That's the sort of impression I get. He's literally doing this for his family now. Okay, that's fine. Sorry guys, I was I was really overexposed pretty much that entire time. I really like the McFarlands. They're really nice. Anyways, my wife is kind of like you, Miss McFarland. Is that so? She's always been a woman in a man's world. You don't talk about her very much. Looks like the ranch hands up ahead. Oh, here. Ride behind the herd. Okay. Oh, it's right near Armadillo then. I can't even see the herd yet. Oh, they're there. I see it. Then she said she'd give me a signal. Oh, they're gonna, yeah, because we're gonna. Right, hang on. 
So I've got to get behind. Let's not scare him. Let's wait then. She didn't tell me what the signal was though. Come on. No. No stop. Let's go. This way. What are they doing? What are they do Let's go. This has turned into a disaster, hasn't it? There you go, there you go, there you go. Move it up. No, this way, this way, this way. Th I'm behind the herd, man. What do you mean right behind the herd? I was behind the herd. These two are yeah. Look, look. It's not my fault that they're being idiots. Look at them. There we go. I said they're being idiots. That that that. Stay together, you dumb animals. Come on. Let's move here, my four-legged friends. There we go. Come on, come on. There we go, there we go, there we go. Nice work. Looks like we got the lot of them. What magnificent animals they are. Hey, the stallion's getting away. Chase him down. And yep, him back. that's fun. This. Oh my gosh, he is fast. What? The stallion has gone, bro. Damn, look how fast he's going. Oh my gosh. Come on, bro, you gotta slow down at some point. And then it doesn't lock on. Oh well, that lock on's ruined me. Oh, the lock on's ruined me, man. What? John, 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 please lock on. John, please lock on, bro. Just lock on. Why aren't you locking on anymore? What happened, bro? What happened to you? It's just running around in circles, it There we go. Come here, boy. You're mine now. Ooh. Come on, baby. Calm down. He's got... John has got more balls in than me. I would not be doing this. This horse right now wants to just kick you in the head, bro. I'll be honest with you. Like, I... This horse is angry. But he's coming down. He's coming down. He's coming down. He's coming down. Come on, that's it. It's done. 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 Let's 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 go. All right, my horse is following me, which is good. Get get down here. Thank you. There you go, Bonnie. I've got your horse. Let's go. Awesome stuff. Thanks for your help today, Mr. Marston. We got some fine horses. You know, why don't you keep that stallion as your own? As a thank you from all of us. Come on, let's go. He's a fine animal. He is indeed. Gotta think of a name, gotta think of a name. He was fast. Something to do with speed. Something to do with being fast and speed. So let's just, still hasn't, there we go, right. So let's go over here and then let's just, why is someone outside my house? Who are you? 
You can now... Wait, what does that say? Oh, I didn't even read that. Right, you've earned enough trust. And also your amount is now maximum stamina. Really? I've earned complete trust and loyalty. I've only had it two seconds. Or does it mean my other amount? I don't know. Do I have any other outfits? I don't think I do. I'm sure I don't. It said I did though. So weird. I only have the one. So let's save the game. Okay, guys, uh, we're going to leave it there. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a like, comment down below, subscribe to the channel. I can't wait to play more of this, man. We're going to go and talk to Bonnie again, I think, and then we're going to do the other one because I don't know who that is. So thank you for watching. I will see you all in the next one.